Hey everyone, it's Allie with Bold North Frenchies. I really felt compelled to do this video because this is a question I get asked a lot. And it is about when and how to wean French Bulldog puppies. So first, let's start at the beginning. Uh, before there were whelp whelpers, before um, even Frenchie breeders were around, <laughs> mother dogs naturally weaned their puppies no problem. Keep that in mind. You are not in charge of the weaning process. You are there literally as a personal assistant to mom. So when I hear breeders say, I pulled puppies off mom at four weeks, it upsets me a little bit because you, then you're wondering why mom is getting mastitis or engorged um, and maybe why puppies are having a hard transition to mush. What we start doing is at four weeks, we start introducing mush. So we have a mush mixture. We do raw food, pumpkin, rice cereal, and uh, distilled water. And I have that recipe on my YouTube. Uh, we will introduce that a few times a day. That's at four weeks. Doesn't mean the puppies are going to want it at four weeks, but it's a good way. Some of them will, some of them won't. And then we continue to allow to let them nurse. At that point, by four weeks, you already have a pretty good schedule with mom, probably every three to four hours, maybe um, probably closer to four, every four hours. And so what we can do is offer mush and then maybe a couple hours later, they nurse a little bit, or maybe they eat a little bit of mush and finish it off by nursing. Be a little loose with this. Just pay attention to how the puppies are responding to the mush and if mom is still interested in nursing. Um, you're not going to end up with a 12-week-old puppy that is still nursing, okay? So what happens is usually by week five, they fall in love with the mush, they become less hungry, and nursing becomes more of a soothing comfort thing than a get nutrients thing. Mom at five weeks starts to slowly diminish her milk supply because puppies are nursing less. Milk is all about supply and demand. When there's a lot of demand, her body will supply a lot. When the demand is less, her body will slowly supply less. That's just an old age uh, rule about nursing, whether it be with humans or dogs, it's all about supply and demand, okay? So as at five weeks, they start eating more of the mush they start nursing less and mom, her milk supply naturally dries up. Usually by about six weeks, mom is completely out of the picture. She may come down and visit puppies and play with them. They may still try to nurse, but it's again, more for a comfort thing. They're not getting a lot of milk or nutrients out of there. And um, then by six weeks, we will completely switch them over. We do raw food diet, or if you're doing uh, kibble, you can completely switch them over to kibble. Um, if you're doing the mush with the kibble, make sure that at about five and a half, uh, maybe at the end of the week five, you're sprinkling some kibble into the mush so they get used, they have teeth, they get used to starting to chew that kibble. Um, but again, don't force the issue. This is not up for you to decide when puppies are done nursing. This is up for mom and puppies to decide when they are done nursing. You just simply start offering that mush at four weeks. People also will ask me, when do you start offering water? I will start offering water at about three, three and a half weeks. I'll just have it out in a really shallow chicken feeder bowl. Puppies typically won't be super interested in it, but some will, and it will become a normal thing in their whelping area to walk over and get water. Okay. So again, remember in this whole process that you are the, uh, a personal assistant to mom. You are not in charge. Uh, you are not nursing these babies. You are not, uh, you do not have that bond and that uh, mother nature connection that mom has with these babies. You are there to follow mom's lead, okay? So again, if you're a breeder and you're deciding at four weeks to pull puppies from mom, cold turkey, please don't do that. Go back to the basics hundreds of years ago, what has worked, and guide along that path. Hopefully you guys found this helpful. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Have a great day.